Today, I'm going to play Mr. Do on the ColecoVision. I'm going to play skill level one and I'm going to show all the features of the game. So in Mr. Do you can clear a board that's your objective and there are two ways, well there's a few ways to do it. One is to kill all the monsters. The second way is to eat all the cherries. Another way is to spell the word extra and you get a free Mr. Do and then the screen clears that can help you in a pinch and the other way is to get a diamond I did clear the board and if you notice the boards are shaped like numbers the first one was number one now this is number two now Mr. Do's defenses are one he can dig the monsters can only dig if they get mad as we'll see the other defense is he has a magic ball and if the ball hits any monster oh right there okay if you, that was, I got the food a food prize appears the monsters are covering it If you get the food prize, the letter guy up top comes out if it's not red. If it's red, it means you already got the food prize. So here I'm killing the monsters. I'm also getting the cherries at the same time. If you eat a group of cherries without pausing, you get a little bonus. And you can hear the music rise up. So the ball will kill any monster. And the only problem is every time you shoot the ball, the longer it takes to come back. So you can't just shoot them all in a row. The ball will bounce, it can bounce right back to you and you'll catch it again. So right there I got the food. Oh, oh, you can also squish them with an apple like I just did. And I just cleared this board. If you notice on the top right it says PH4. I believe that stands for phase, just the same thing as level. So I'm on level four, and it's shaped like a four. Now the cake is there. So I might want to try to get a free guy. I'm gonna have to time it so that my, that letter guy is on a letter I haven't selected yet. Also, I should note, every 10,000 points, the letter guy will come out all alone if it's yellow. Red, he always stays up. I'm gonna try to get this X. Those blue guys, they'll just eat through everything and they'll try to get you. The diamond will come out of an apple only by chance and only if it's the last apple. So you have to get you have to destroy all the apples. No diamond. Now I'll be on phase five. It'll be shaped like a five. And it's good to build your path with bends like I'm doing not super straight because the monsters get confused a little better and you get a little extra time I know what you're thinking you're like snarf max they're kinda slow well the interesting thing about this game is the game just keeps getting faster and there's no strategy at some point you just die all the time the only way you are surviving is by luck so Enjoy the slowness while you can. Alright, I'm gonna get that R. If I kill the last blue monster, the purple ones come back to life. Or get unfrozen. They're not dead. 
Let me try to get this R. And you can do this as long as you want. And the easiest level of the game is easy, but it doesn't stay easy. I might do a marathon game starting at the easiest level and see how far I can get. Alright, now uh, let me see if I can get a diamond out of this thing. Nope. You'll know it when there's a diamond. It just takes over all the sound. It's kind of cool. In the arcade, you used to get a totally free game if you got the diamond in the arcade. But then, in some states, that was considered gambling. So they had to change it so you get a free guy instead. I like the food prizes. They're kind of interesting. I think those are graham crackers. I think it's always some confectionery. That white thing, those, now they can dig. An apple can crush you. Get out of here. See, I made it. And no diamond. Now comes board seven. I'd also like to point out that the boards will have different configurations of where the apples are so you can have a better apple positioning than a previous board this isn't the ideal seven apple board yeah this one's pretty hard I don't like 7 in the faster levels, it's, it's brutal. I'm going to play a game where I'm on the hardest level. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, what happened there, it's worth noting, if you push up under an apple, you can go inside the apple just a little bit, and then you get stuck. And then you get trapped. I'm going to try to get a free guy. Hopefully I can show you what a free guy looks like. Boom. Congratulations, you win an extra Mr. Do. It turns green. There's your celebration. The arcade has a better window of that. I think he throws a ball right in the monster's face. And see what I did there? I sh I shot through a thin layer of dirt. Very important. Now, Mr. R is out. I'm gonna go get him. And I'll turn red. Now, if you get the food when the guy is red, the purple monsters freeze for a few seconds. Oh, now my ball's stuck in a circle. I'm in a little bit of trouble here. Might just get the cherries and get out. Oh, God, that guy squished himself. So, those few seconds can be very helpful. Sometimes it's better not to get the, the letter guy out. Alright, let's see if there's a diamond. Oh, there's a diamond. Let's see if I can get it. I love that sound. I had to. I, I couldn't get the diamond. I couldn't. It wasn't worth it. It's only 10,000. It's not worth a life. Even though you can get unlimited lives, you really have to earn them. You have to get that letter guy five times. Good luck. Right now it looks easy. This is nine. So we can squish some. I got to admit, I'm kind of mad I missed that diamond. Oh, I hate those. And Mr. T out. Nailed him. An expert player 
will shoot their ball right up in that top part and then have Mr. Oh, Diamond, the game, listen to me. Boom. You get 10,000 points. I believe in the arcade there is a better, like, intermission. Now I got Mr. E right there. Now if I get an A, I get another Mr. Do. I see those purple monsters are faster. Guys that dig, they uh, oh, I'm not gonna make it. Those guys that dig, they screw up everything. Now I get the food. And that's pretty much the whole game. I'll shut up now. Oh, there I made what I call, I made it what I call a death ditch. And what that is, if, if you dig a little under the apple, the purple guys try to escape, and they can't, and they get stuck. And uh, it's a, I call that a death ditch. Oh, I gotta watch out. You can, you know, as you can see, I can push the apples, but you can't push an apple against a blue guy, and then they just dig around you and mess things up. Ugh. These guys move so fast, you can barely push an apple on top of them. Bonk. And of course, the more you kill at once, the more points you get. Better, I'm in trouble. So that was Mr. Do. I got 125,000. I might make another video of a super high score and maybe play some music with it. Bye.